guys. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. For those that are just tuning in, my name is Zaina. And my name is Mohammed. Before we get into this video, if you guys have not yet subscribed to our channel, please make sure to hit that subscribe button below. We would love for you guys to join our YouTube family. Okay, so for this video, we're going to do a language challenge, but it's a little different than the ones you've seen. So what we're gonna do is, I wrote five sentences in, in Turkish, Turkish. And I wrote five sentences in Arabic. For those that don't know, I'm Arabic, I'm not Arabic. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm Arab, I speak Arabic, and Muhammad is Turkish. He speaks Turkish. So we thought it would be funny for us to like read out each other's sentences in each other's languages and kind of see who pronounces it better, right? And also kind of guess what the other person is wrote. Saying. Yeah. Or saying. What the other person wrote. Alright, so let's go. So we put five different sentences in this hat, this wonderful hat. Obviously, Zayna would own something like this. I never even wore it. I still have the price tag. I still Again, have the something price tag. Zayna would do. <laughs> All right, so we'll start off with Zayna. I'll go first. Yeah. <gasps> okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, you can put the hat down. Okay. This is going to be so embarrassing. I'm going to butcher the <laughs> out of this. Okay. Muhammad. <clears throat> Muhammad Benden Daha Akili. <laughs> what? Bro, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> oh my god. So, obviously, my name she pronounced right. Ben Den, you did pretty good. What did you say here? Daha. I'll give you a 6 out of 10. Akili. Okay, that's butchered. <laughs> what is it? Okay, so you guys heard me pronounce it, so you pronounce it. So it's Mohammed Ben Den Daha Akulu. Akulu. You just Akulu. wait. You just okay, wait. Okay, so I, I. So just guess, what is it? Mohammed. Like a quick guess. Just, we get one <gasps> guess because there's a lot of questions, so we need to get through these quick. Oh, but this is not. Oh, I don't know. And if you take this long, we're gonna be. Yeah, here all exactly. Day. That's why. How am I supposed just, to get? Just okay, quick. Muhammad freaking loves me. No, <laughs> it's actually Muhammad is smarter than me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's my turn. I don't get a point because I was blocked. Okay, so I'm gonna pick up one of these gigantic. No, no, pick another one. You picked the same one! I guess it's fate. What is this? She wrote a paragraph. No, I wrote Okay. <laughs> Ana Amar Arabat Dai Sharabas. <laughs> Ana Lazim Itadab Hab. That you, um, you had, you, you, you could. What? <laughs> Yo, know. you read that way too fast. You Ana Amar Arabat Sharabas. Ana Lazim Itad Itadab. Habatai. Read it Hamad. properly. Uh, the whole point is it's a challenge. I can't read it properly. And you're okay, so too I'm, fast. Yo, yo, you got like negative 10. The thing about her is if I keep saying she sucks, she's going to say the no, same thing to no, me. No, 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 no. Okay, this is what I tried to have him read. Ana Amar Arbatashar, bas ana lazim et adab habitain kamen. You wrote a novel. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna guess that this says. You're not gonna guess. You're the love of my life, and I need you. <laughs> no, I wrote. I'm like the full moon, but I need to learn a little bit of adab. I need to learn more manners. Oh, you're like directing that to me. No. Yeah, you better not be. I just wrote whatever came to my mind. Okay, go. Oh. Can't get over how small these are. That's how you normally do it. Whoa! What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? He even has like the accents and stuff. Okay. Aya Kabilarin Gok Guzel. Whoa. What? That was really. That was actually that was extreme really butcher. I'm good. not even hating. Aya Kabilarin Chok Guzel. What does this mean? I could learn chokuzem. I don't know what that means, man. I could learn It just means. I could learn chokuzem. I could learn chokuzem. Gazelle. It means. Gazelle. Oh, I am. I look no, like no, a gazelle. No. <laughs> Is that your attempt to be funny? <laughs> that was really good. That was really good, you guys. No. I look like a gazelle, a beautiful yeah. gazelle. Yeah, anyways. Uh, what does it mean then? Oh, your shoes are really nice. I like it. Your shoes are nice. Gazelle's shoes? I kubladun. I kubladun is like your shoes. What does gazelle mean? Nice. Yeah, so I was pretty close. I said gazelle. You said gazelle. Hey, yeah, yo. like a gazelle. No, you, you said gazelle like the animal. It's your turn, weirdo. Wait. 
Wait, I gotta shuffle it. Okay, go. What the hell is this? <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm pretty good at this one. Let me see, what is it? Zayna ahla bint fil dunya wa ana bahibba awi. And um, I'm pretty sure she's saying <laughs> Zena is my dunya and I love her so much. Very close. Zena is the point. most beautiful girl in the world and I love her so much. Okay, so I get a point. Yeah, you do get a point. And I don't think you have any. I do have a point from the gazelle one. I'm Pronu get, no, no. I pronounced no, it right. No, no, the no, chuck no. gazelle. Yeah, but like those are simple. Like you gotta get that eye cabal. Okay, fine. So you're one point, I'm zero? Yes, sir. All right. Senin kafan chok buyuk. Woo! That was good. That was good. I know that was. Say it again. Senin kafan chok buyuk. Senin kafan chok buyuk. All right, I'll give you that. Like, be, it's buyuk, but I'll get everything. Nah, else nah, I got it. Close. So I definitely got a point for this. Yeah, I'll give you that. The funny thing is, she's so happy saying that, and she doesn't even know what it means. Senin kafan chok buyuk. It actually fits her right now. That's pretty ironic. It means your head is big. Are you dumb? That's so funny because I have one that says that about you. I feel let go. And my head is not big. Whoa. An hamar. An hamar. An hamar. Like here and say. An hamar. An hamar. No, there's no ha. An hamar. <laughs> what does that mean? You're a donkey. <laughs> All right, cool. So I'm up two to one. Obviously, I win every challenge versus Zena. Come on, guys. Is this even a challenge? Napier Sen Sen? Ooh. Yeah, that's right. Mm. Yeah, what do you mean? Hmm, We're that's about to right. award half points. Dude. It's Napier Sen Sen. Napier Sen Sen. Napier Sen Sen. Okay, fine, fine. I'll give it to you. What, what is it? Glitter mean? dust. <laughs> I don't know what it means. You get one guess. My hair is nappy. It means what are you doing? All right, so Rasi Kabir, slow it down. Rasi Kabir, what? Bidaya Kabir, bas Ayuni, Suharia, Suhariara. Guys, okay, honestly, Arabic is so much harder than Turkish. Okay, this is what I. What I said. Rasi kbir, kbir, wa idaya. There's no ain. Idaya kbar, bas ayuni sugayara. Oh, do you guys see? I say na person sent, and then she gives me a paragraph. Like, come on, guys. Like, what does Rasi kbir mean? Love you a lot. No. My head is my big. Head is big. Wa idaya. Idaya is my hands. Kbar. Wa idaya. And my hands are big. My head is big and my hands are big. But. Ayuni sugayara, but my eyes are small. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna just give myself the L. <laughs> okay, this is the last one. So I guess since we're tied, whoever gets this last point wins. Yeah, but like the last one I'm looking at already looks like a novel. Napalim bugun. That's pretty trash. Napalim Arabic is so bugun. much harder, so you got a zero on that. Okay, fine. How about this? If you can figure out what it is, I'll give you a point. What are you doing tomorrow? What are we doing today? It was zero. so close. So this is the moment of truth. If I can figure out what Dana wrote here, He's although not. it's a novel. And if it's a tiebreaker, we'll let you guys decide. I'm sure there's a lot of Arabs that watch this vlog and a lot of, or at least a few Turkish people I see you guys commenting. So shout out my fellow Turks. Whoa, that's a long one. Ana ismi Batika wa ana bahib nafsi gidan. And Ramil. Okay, that's pretty good. Yeah, I, I okay. felt like that was pretty good. That was pretty I good. I can't even. Good. Okay, basically, I said, Ana ismi batiha, wa ana bahib nafsi giddan. Okay, let me, let, let me try to guess. Ana ismi batiha, so you said my name is Watermelon? Woo! So. Basically, I said, My name is Watermelon, and I love myself a lot, and I'm beautiful. Well, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that.
Okay, so you definitely won that one. All right, guys. So I just won. Usually, I feel like there should be a punishment for the loser. Okay, so give me a dare. Um, <laughs> we'll do a tablespoon of cinnamon. No, I hate that kind of stuff. That's the whole point. Okay, so guys. So the loser of this Friday's face-off has to do a punishment. We'll make a wheel of punishments and we'll spin it. And then whatever we land on, the losing person has to do. So yeah, please leave us suggestions for the next video. This yes. one, we'll let Zayna go. because she's yeah! He keeps crying. So, for the next one, we're going to make a wheel. We need punishments from you guys. Uh, Zayna will put up a poll um, or a questionnaire. Maybe we'll pull up a poll of punishments and then we'll get them to vote or sure. we'll get them to send them punishments. Sure. So, thank you guys so much for watching our language challenge. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button below. Give this video a thumbs up if you guys liked it. Leave us a comment and let us know any other challenges that you want us to try do or, or try out. Yeah. Anyways, guys, we'll see you in our next video.